Now, speaking yesterday at the Faith and Freedom Coalition in Washington, Ted Cruz was apparently rudely cut off after what I assumed that they had believed was the end of his speech. Let's take a look at that. So what I want to say to the men and women here is two things. Number one, thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you for your prayers. Thank you for your passion. Thank you for your time. Thank you for your energy. Thank you for speaking out and working to retake our nation. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome to the stage the Southern Regional Director of Faith and Freedom Coalition, Virginia Galloway. <laughs> Oops. Hey, man, uh, guys, I, I wasn't done yet. I, I still had more speech to go. I, I wanted to say something. sad look when you think about it i look i almost feel bad for him but then of course when i start to i remember how much of a despicable human being he is so but anyway so now while i think it's still fair to say that he was absolutely rudely cut off yeah, it's just obvious that he wasn't done with the speech they didn't care they're like go get out of here you're done you're done ted go in fact uh you, we're gonna kick you out the door <laughs> Now, that, of course, begs the question of which was more embarrassing, what happened to Ted Cruz or this? That's it. Thank you. They're kicking me out the door. They're kicking me out the door. Governor, so, thank you very much for joining us today. Um, <laughs> I swear to God, that never gets old. <laughs> Although, I think, in, in my opinion, I think Jeb Bush, a little bit more cringy than Ted Cruz. However, uh, what's even more cringy is that, actually, we do have a picture of Ted Cruz after this happened. Let's take a look at that. Oh. <laughs> Sad. Hey, everybody. Thanks for watching this video. If you want to see more like this, please hit the subscribe button below. And if you want to support truly independent progressive media, please consider becoming a patron at patreon.com slash TYT Nation.